So if you've ever had a broken bone, what's the first thing you have to do? They got to reset the bone, right? They just can't say, well, you know what? Let's just see what it looks like. You know, I'm just, you know, it'll fix itself. You know, it's like, no, you, you got to reset the bone. They had to do that with my pinky. Um, they, they didn't have to do that as much with, with my son. I have one, out of the three kids, one has broken a bone. It was JJ. And it was, I remember the day it happened because uh, they were little, they were all riding a skateboard and there were like all three of them, actually two, my oldest and my youngest. And they were just sitting, just kind of like bobsledding down the, you know, down the driveway. Right when they get to the street, he, JJ puts his feet on the ground and kind of goes launching because Josue is twice his size, still going behind him, rams into his back right leg. And he, me, I'm sitting there, you know, I'm on dad duty, paying attention, right? I was paying attention. Mom was not in the, nowhere near that I was paying attention. And I'm sitting at the top and then he starts flopping like a fish out of water. First thing I said was, he broke it. Oh man, he broke it. Of course, she's not here. It's my fault. Oh my gosh. It's like, of course, this is my life, you know, whatever. And so I was really freaking out. And, and I was, you know, at the beginning, I was like, no, 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 you're, you're fine. You're fine. You know, just suck it up. It was, it just hurt, you know, but then I could tell it, we went spiral fracture. And so, but what was crazy is when you get a broken bone, what do you have to do? Put it in the cast. Why? to immobilize it, right? He had a big, we, we, took, uh, we took advantage of that cast when we went to Disney, first, first written everything. I mean, I, uh, I, hey, disabled, okay? I need to cut lines. So I loved it. I, that day at Disney was glorious. It was a great day, one of the best days ever, and it was fun. And so, but why do they put it in a cast? Because you gotta immobilize it. Why? You can't move it. Why? Because the body is trying to heal itself. And what's interesting is that when you break a bone, the mind sends blood to that area and it creates a callus around the break. And the blood, that the, the extra blood around the break is sent there and it's, it creates a callus and you don't wanna, you put it in a cast so you allow the body to do what it's trying to do. Because when the blood finishes working on the break, it's almost like if the break never happened. That's what the blood does. So let me read that again. Jesus, risen from the dead, fullness of God in him, to reconcile everything to himself on earth and in heaven, to make peace through his blood shed on the cross. Guys, us, everybody, we are all born broken. That's what sin is. Our sin nature is, guys, we're born broken. We are born in a broken state and um, broken people and when we come to Christ, the Holy Spirit binds us back to God and the blood of Jesus covers us and begins to work in us to almost as if it nothing ever happened. That's what the blood, that's what it means to be saved and to brought back. He says, that's what he does for us. What else can do that? Who else can do that? Nothing. And when that is solid and his work is solid, his work is solid and cannot be unbroken again. 